The Life Skills Training Workshop is a collaborative initiative between AA Tribal and New Power Limited. It will run for two weeks. Three trainees have been deployed to Kido Village to assist lead trainer Anna Amos, a UPNG Arts School lecturer, to teach young women basic skills in sewing, tie-dyeing and screen printing. Cooking would be a later addition. New Power Limited External Affairs Manager Wellington Bellowa thanked the Kido Women's Association and everyone involved in making this community investment program a success for the benefit of the women folk. The people who are running this course or who will be running this training, uh, they actually, the, the leader is also a lecturer at the University of Papua New Guinea Art School. So they are here with you to run the program for two weeks. Now here we have five sewing machines. Janet Yeager, a passionate community service leader in supporting women and girls, is looking forward to being part of the training. We are ever grateful to New Power for the opportunity to come out to the villages and impart our skills and knowledge. This training is a 10-day transformation training, meaning that within 10 days, just 10 days, we expect you to produce something. It's not complex, it's simple, but it's worthwhile. Ward 7 Council Lady Kaya Podiap thanked New Power Limited for the much-needed manual sewing machines as Kido has no electricity. Other support items include six 9,000-litre water tanks and two vaccination fridges to store vaccinations for women and children in light of the COVID pandemic. Kido lacks three main necessities, electricity, water accessibility and medical, but through new power and other generous groups, the future is slowly looking brighter. Thank you, new power! I'm Carol Kido Jr., TV1 News.